Hey everyone, welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. So today we have a drag build and tune for the 2014 Lamborghini Huracan. So if you enjoy the video or find it helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. All right, so first off, we're gonna bring the Hurricane up to the festival drag strip so that we can see how fast it can get by the speed trap at the end. So pulling up into the staging booths here, we're gonna launch this car from about 4,000 RPM. Let's drop it there. Shouldn't get any wheel spin at all. And even if you do, you will still launch very fast. Up into fifth gear, we're gonna hold this till the speed trap and we got a speed of 330 kilometers an hour. All right, so now we're taking the 2014 Hurricane into the Festival Drag Strip race. This is so we can see how fast it is against the AI players, the other cars, as well as getting a time by the end of this run. So launching here should be on par with everyone else we're currently sitting in first but we might get overtaken because we're on the unbeatable ai up into sixth gear now we cross that line we might have won that race and we got a time of 14.0 seconds all right, so now that we've seen how fast our 2014 Lamborghini Huracan is, we'll now take it into the festival and I'll show you how to upgrade and tune it. All right, so with a stock 2014 Lamborghini Huracan LP610-4, you wanna come into the custom upgrade menu here. So first off, we'll come down to the conversions tab. We're gonna leave the stock engine in the car as that makes the most power as well as it is already all wheel drive, but we'll be putting on the twin turbos as well as putting the Liberty Walk wide body kit on as this makes the car lighter somehow. Throw that on there, come out of the conversion tab. Don't need to come into aero and appearance as all of these options just add weight. Add them if you want, but do note it will make the car slower. So. And come out of air and appearance snap into tires and rims in here we'll be putting on the drag tire compound as well as making the front and rear tires as wide as possible then changing out the rim style for something more lightweight pick whatever you want here as long as it is as light as possible so we can come out of the tires and rims now and into the drivetrain so in here, we're putting in the race clutch, then the race transmission, race driveline, and the race diff. So out of drivetrain, now into platform and handling. So in here, you'll be putting in the rally or off-road springs and dampeners, then the race front and rear anti-roll bars, and then the race weight reduction out of platform and handling now into engine. So in here, we'll be putting in the race intake, race fuel system, race ignition, race exhaust, race valves, race engine block, then the race twin turbos, race intercooler, and then the race flywheel. So that's it as far as upgrades go for the Hurricane. So you can go ahead and apply all of these. All right, so now that we've upgraded our Hurricane, we can now come over to the custom tuning menu here. So first I'll show you the metric tune and then I'll show you the differences for the Imperial tune and I'll leave the tune code on screen now. So for your front and rear tie pressures, we're just gonna set these down to 1.0 bar. Then if we come over to the gearing, we're gonna set our final drive here down to 3.65. First, we'll set this to 3.80. Second, we'll be set to 2.30. Third gear, we'll leave at 1.60. Fourth, we'll change this to 1.19. Fifth, we'll be set to 0.94. Come down to there. 6 will be set to 0 
and you can leave 7th at 0.70. So next is the alignment. We're gonna set our front and rear camber angles here to zero degrees. Then our front cast angle to seven degrees. Next is the anti-roll bars. We'll stiffen these up as much as possible in the front and rear. So you just wanna hit 65.0 for both of those. So next is the springs. In the front here, we'll set this to 57.0 come up a bit to there then in the rear we'll be going up to 61.5 just like that then for the ride heights in the front we'll leave this at 14.7 but the rear we're going to drop this to the 11.8 so next is dampening so for your front rebound stiffness here we'll set this down to 1.7 come all the way down to there rear will be set to 3.6 just like that then for the bump stiffness we're going to set the front here up to 9.5 then the rear will be setting this to 10.8 so next is the arrow we're just going to bring this all the way to speed for the front which is 75 can't change the rear here so we'll just leave it so then finally is the differential tab at the end. We're gonna bring the front acceleration up to 90%. Then the rear acceleration will be bringing this up to 95%. And then the center balance, we're gonna bring this up to 77%. So that's it as far as the metric tune goes for the Hurricane. Let's so now I'll show you the differences for the Imperial tune. All right, so as far as differences go for the Imperial tune is you want 15 PSI in both the front and the rear tires. Then if we come over to the Springs tab, you want 319 in the front, 344 in the rear. Then for the ride heights, you want 5.8 in the front and 4.6 in the rear. Then if we come over to the arrow, you just want to set your front downforce down to 166. So that's it as far as the differences go for the Imperial tune. So you can go ahead and apply all of these. All right, everyone. So this has been a drag build and tune for the 2014 Lamborghini Huracan. So if you enjoyed the video or found it helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe.